earthquake is going to be observed just a little later on this month. But this Saturday, KTLA is going to be presenting a very special news production called When Disaster Strikes, A Survival Guide. That program is going to take a look at the threats and what we can do. So we thought that we'd get Gail Anderson down in South L.A. with a new homeowner interested in uh, some of this help that's available to us all. Hi, Gail. Exactly. Um, Northridge was my first earthquake, scared the daylights out of me, and I saw a lot of china cabinet, cabinets like this one, uh, your china cabinet, uh, cabinet, Sylvia, tossed, thrown in the middle of the floor as though King Kong had been in there. So we're going to show you how to do some things to protect your home. Let's show you a little bit of this um, footage from our special Saturday. As Michaela and uh, Emmett have described to you, it's when disaster strikes, 8 p.m. Saturday night. Lots of useful, important information. So we're here uh, with Sylvia. Habitat for Humanity homeowner. Home is secure, but you need a little extra help. Yes. The right. more help I have, the better. All right, so we got Home Depot and the folks from Quake Hold here. We're going to show you something real quick here. We want you to know, though, as we show you a little tape of Habitat for Humanity, these homes are very secure to begin with. That's but right. you want to secure the inside. Isn't that right, Erin? Right. Right. We build our homes to the highest earthquake standards, so the home, will, the home is safe, but we want to make sure that all the stuff inside the home doesn't fall over when an earthquake hits. All right, we'll talk more about that a little bit. All right, now, Brian Lowe, what do you have here? Because she's got a china cabinet. That stuff is going to be on the floor. Exactly. That stuff falls on the floor, crashes, and uh, you've got trouble. So uh, the way to protect that is to use one of these furniture this, straps. This is the quake hold here. And this is the quake hold and putty you... that you actually uh, put underneath oh, things. And that. as you can see, it uh, helps, you know, to hold things in place. All right, now how do we get that on there? Well, you have a uh, quake hold putty package. You get uh, the putty in the uh, thing over here. Easy to Roll use? It. Very easy to use. Okay. Roll it into your uh, okay. little balls about the size of a pea. Put them on the bottom of the item. Right. And uh, stick it down with a press and a twist, and Bob's your uncle. It's good to go. All right. Now, let us show you uh, a little bit of uh, this tape of Home Depot, because they're doing a free clinic Saturday. They're having one in Burbank, and this is the kind of thing they do regularly, because so many of us women bought homes, and then we needed to figure out how to get, get all that stuff in there. Now, we want to show you another thing that they're going to be teaching for free this Saturday, uh, how to keep our DVD player safe there and yes. our electronics. Yes, this is a self-adhesive buckle mm -hmm. and a nylon strap mm -hmm. and you just put it on like that and you set it down there and you do the same thing with this one and you press it down and wow. it's done. And what's amazing about this stuff, some of the things I saw during the, after the Northridge quake had a lot of Velcro, not these things. These are a little more mobile. You can move them around. Yeah, they're very easy to move. All right, let's give you some information. We're going to show you, as, we, as they wrap up and put this on the wall, we're going to show you how that works next hour. We're going to give you some information. If you want more information about how to become a Habitat for Humanity homeowner, here's that information, phone number. And they have their own little store where you, you want to donate stuff so they can help other homeowners. You can do that, too. Then we want to remind you that Home Depot Saturday from 10 a.m. until 2 p.m. is having a free earthquake safety clinic. There's the address on Flower Street, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. They'll be teaching and showing you some of the things we're showing you this morning and again after you get all your stuff rounded up that morning you can watch our special saturday night at eight o'clock when disaster strikes we're going to show you more earthquake preparedness as well as any other kind of preparedness next hour we've been making notes already gail thank you thanks Gilly. still ahead a new study gets very specific about how tv and music may actually influence teenagers to have sex earlier